Hello, welcome back to Linus Wednesdays, where we look at Linus tips and tricks on a Wednesday. And in this video, we're going to look at a program called Pling Store, which is like the App Store. You can download things like games, applications, wallpapers, themes, icons, and so on. And you'll find Pling Store at https colon forward slash forward slash store dot kd dot org forward slash p forward slash one one seven five for a tone. I'll link that in the description below, so you just need to click on that. If you click on download, click on Pling Store App Image, which is 5.0.2.1, and press on download. Once you've downloaded it and saved it, if you right click on the icon, choose properties, click on permissions, and go allow execute and file as a program. Now, all we need to do is double click, and the Pling Store will run. If you wish to make an icon for the Pling Store, so you don't want that nasty old spur gear, right click, choose properties. Click here and find the icon you want to use. So you can download a PNG icon and you can you can use that as your Pling Store icon. Get rid of this ugly spur gear. But I'll leave it as it is for the purpose of the video. And it says Pling. You can chat to people about it, register, log in, got community, go about. If we go about, you've got things like there, you go about. And it says about opendesktop.org and it says community and so on. If you wish to donate, you can donate because a lot, a lot of people don't uh, want to want to donate. Uh, you can be. It says 204 people support those who create freedom. See all, become a supporter. There you go. Now on the side here, on the side, you've got things like app add-ons, apps, art, books, comics, distros, and so on. If I click on apps, you got things like audio, games, and so on. Let's click on games. You've got here on the other side, you've got arcade, board, card, chess, emulation. Let's try some emulation. And we've got things like, oh, there's a dolphin emulator there. You can uh, play GameCube games and Wii on uh, that format there. Linux and Mac OS, lovely. And the recent Android devices. So, say I wanted to download MGBA to play some Game Boy Advance games. I won't tell you where to get the ROMs from. Just search there online. I'm sure you'll find them. If you click on MGBA, it tells you all about it down there. It says there's one file. Ratings and reviews, you can read a review about it. it. Just says great. If I click on files, now I can click on the app image, DL or OS install, or I can download it from here. If I just press on install and then click on uh, MGBA and press install, on the folder here, it's got download installed. Press on download, you'll see there it's downloading our image. The file has been installed as a program. Click on software. Now this is very hard to make it run. Just press on run. And here we go. The GBA emulator opened up. And you can then open your ROMs up and start playing some Mario Kart, Mario Brothers and so on. The good thing about using the emulator is you can actually see the screen. Unless you've got an AGS-001, I think it's a 001, with a flip screen on the Game Boy Advance SP. It's very, very hard to see the screen on the GBA. Although the GBA Micro you can see the screen on, but it's a bit too small. If wish to remove the, icon, uh, the application, I can click on delete. If we go back and we go on to wallpapers, and there's quite a lot of wallpapers to go through here. I'm not going to go through every single one. We'll be here all, all, all night. You've got things like animals, abstract, uh, beaches and oceans. Let's click on that one. Let's try... Uh, I'm not going to do that one because that looks like a Windows windows thing let's try this one here here we go you've got files one it says description 1920 by 1200 full hd wallpaper okay i'm going to click on download i'm going to click on here click on download it's going to ask me where i want to save it i'll save it to my desktop there we go i can then open it up from this view View enter full screen. There you go. That's what we just downloaded. Check that out. That's quite good. That does. F11 to get our image view full screen. And here's some more that I downloaded. And there's one more there that I downloaded from from the uh, Pling Store. There's loads of applications and stuff in the Pling Store. Too many to go through. But I'd say give Pling Store a try. Let me know what you download in the comments below. If you find this video of some use, not to do, give it a thumbs up. Don't like the video. And the button seems to work too. But as always, thank you very much for watching Nights Wednesdays. 
I'll see you in the next video.